So, so here we are with Peter Kaiser. Thank you for being here with us. Thank you, you for finding me. <laughs> <laughs> it's always one of those things, right? How like things cross and come together in life. Great. Can you tell us where we are and what are we doing here? Where are we? We're uh, on, on planet Earth. <laughs> In, uh, at in Spiral in uh, Camden Town, London. For whatever reason, the universe brought me here and brought you here. So we here crossed we paths and uh, through our mutual friend we were, Felix. We were asking, yes, we were asking, but well, we should interview him. And suddenly Felix called you and... And boom, boom. Yeah, and then he said like, can we do it over the phone? He's like, no, 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 no. It's better in person. And I'm around the corner from Inspiral. I'm just foraging some wild grass right here, see? I was just out in the park when I got the phone call and I was cutting the grass. It's like, okay, okay, I'll be there in half an hour. And I got some nice dandelions here with me. We'll talk about that all in the, in the moment. This is some plantain that I quickly cut out there. And these are stinging nettles. Beautiful, most nutritious green on the planet. Okay? Excellent. So that's a little... Uh, and this is just grass. Just wild grass, yes. Okay, excellent. It's a wild strain that has not been hybridized by man and it has the highest content of chlorophyll. Of all green things, the most chlorophyll is in the grass. So this is what your, your listeners and, and viewers need to know. This is the key to survival into the 21st century. And one of the reasons it is that is because, first of all, it's abundantly available on the whole planet. Like 60% of the earth, surface of the earth is covered in grasses out there in the wild. So there's an abundance of it. All vegetarian animals feed on it. Cows, zebras, horses, you know, you name it, elephants. The strongest, uh -huh. the strongest land animals are actually vegetarians, you know. Mm -hmm. So, and what makes the grass so interesting for us is like the molecular structure of the chlorophyll molecule is almost identical to the human red blood cell hemoglobin hem hemin actually that's the part of it mm -hmm. so now if you juice this fresh and you drink it and it is for the body like a like a feeling of rejuvenation because it goes instantly in your system there's no digestion needed you can just like instantly absorb the energy and the energy will make you feel like wow uplift your whole vibration instantly you can't be depressed when you drink this stuff so i see to people who have problems with depression drink the green juice because it'll bring up the inner sunshine the inner light it makes you feel like connected to the sun because this is actually this is actually sunlight, okay? Mm -hmm. The Condensed. the sun emits the sun sun rays. The plant captures it through a process called photosynthesis and stores the energy in chlorophyll. So this is liquid sunshine. When you juice this, it's like what comes out is liquid sunshine. Absolutely. And now the other most interesting thing is we will be getting a little sample of it in a moment it's like you take the green coconut right which is in abundance like in ecuador and in south america mm -hmm. and all those places now the liquid of the green coconut is close to the blood plasma now if you take like 50 percent coconut water and 50 percent green juice you basically have a blood transfusion <laughs> instant blood transfusion it's amazing You're and right. it works because you know it was proven in the second world war in the asian theater mm -hmm. when they ran out of blood plasma what they would do is they would inject coconut water directly mm -hmm. to the people who were needing like a blood transfusion and they lived you know so this stuff works this is a proven thing over history yes in northern brazil if you go to the doctor yeah he just recommend for anything you have coconut water coconut water yeah that's it absolutely no if you are pregnant or yeah if you are right <laughs> coconut water is is like if i don't have time to go and forage grasses and instant quick fix is coconut water fresh coconut water always works yeah Excellent. absolutely love it what can we do with all these greens? well well this stuff right here like the dandelions is really good for rejuvenating your liver so what i do is and thistles too so tomorrow when we're going to meet again we're going to make the juice and i show you how i juice this stuff and then you can taste the juice and see it but what I do with this stuff, I eat it along with like sweet fruits, like berries or something. Mm -hmm. So what happens is instead of getting the sugar rush, where you get like this mm -hmm. peak sugar and then you come down, it kind of like you have an extended like high. It's not like, like this peak and then down. Yes. It's more like a continuous linear mm -hmm. high performance. And this is why I eat this along with sweet fruit. It's one of the best things. And when I forage grass, I'm usually very always... Very alkaline. Mm, very alkaline. All the greens are the healers. So this is the key things we need to understand. Now, thistle, I mean, nettles. 
Ortiga. Ortiga. Mm -hmm. Nettles are highest in minerals and uh, and a lot of nutritional value in these things. So what I've started doing is making a pesto out of it. Excellent. So instead of using basil, I use you can still use a little basil, but I use more of this stuff. Okay. And then the same ingredients that you use in the pesto, mm -hmm. you just substitute the basil with the nettles. Mm -hmm. And it's amazing. And it's so nutrient rich and dense that you just feel satiated. You feel really satisfied. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't have any cravings for anything. Great idea. Great idea. And plantain, this other thing here that we have, Plantain is really good for clearing your lungs. If you're like constipated, nice. you have phlegm and you have lungs. It's very bitter, so I don't put a lot in the juice, but it's really good to add it too. So, and it grows in, in abundance. And then thistles I bring tomorrow. I don't have them with me here. And um, yeah, what were you asking? For example, with this grass, yes. if I don't have a wheat grass juicer or right. any juicer, what? can I do like for you can chew on it but it's a slow long process because you chew and chew and chew remember this cow has five stomachs okay so the, the cow chews it there we go so the cow chews it and brings it up and brings it up again thank you okay. you're the man look at this my friends here it is this is the young coconut now the coconut is actually related to the grasses and this is what makes it so interesting did you know that the coconut is 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 as the plant related to the grasses it belongs to the grass families I didn't know that you didn't know that see this is why it's so magical so cheers to salud. our salute salud. this is the real thing from Colombia here in London isn't that the best hmm. oh my god I mean, this is the best drink ever invented. Man cannot improve on this. It, he just can't, okay? Let's just get real and say like, thank you universe for giving us this amazing drink, okay? Absolutely. So, yeah. So maybe, no, maybe no, for sure. For Tomo sure. To tomorrow, <laughs> mm -hmm. we're gonna have you with us at the Wild... At the Wild Food Cafe. Cafe, because they have the Green Star Juicer there, and I like to do it there because I can crank out masses of the green juice and then we can pass it around and everybody can try it and feel it, because it's a feeling experience. So when you drink it, you, you instantly feel connected, you feel centered, because it's like this. If you look at the whole spectrum of light, right? You have from like the darkest, or you look at the chakra system, at the rainbow. It goes from the dark all the way through the green, to the yellow, to the green, to the blue to the purple right so you have all of these things now they have figured out that it's the same thing in the musical note from C to B the highest note you have red to purple and you go through all the colors mm -hmm. but guess what in our system it's the same thing you have on one side acidity and alkalinity on the other side now acidity is extremely red for example you drink a bottle of coca-cola your body goes in total acidic shock okay and you need about five liters of water just to balance that toxic impact of this of that drink right now if you drink this you're like right in the center you don't need anything to balance this balances you right mm -hmm. now if you are and we always want to strive to be on the alkaline side now the greens are by nature alkalinizing so when you eat a lot of greens that's why a lot of people eat salads because salads what they do is like they bring you instantly into this into this zero state you know mm -hmm. center stage it's like the middle ground right there and it's green and the green is connected to the heart too because the heart chakra is green mm -hmm. so what happens is like you're connected more to the heart and this is what's missing in the society and in this place like London people are running around like zombies and like you know all depressed and whatever running after the carrot you know that's somewhere dangling but never getting to the carrot so that's the problem so if they would just chill out and eat some green food and um, more green salads then they would be more connected to the universe mm -hmm. I was at a farmers market the other day and I was shocked you know they were selling breads and cheese and meat and olives but like very little greens there was like one stand who had a little green stuff and this is what's missing in people's eating habits it's greens we need to go to the greens we need to learn from the animals they go to the greens even the dogs if the dogs are sick or the cats they go to the grass and eat the grass because they know that's the only thing that can make him well again you see thank you for being here with us and tomorrow we're gonna juice and get into the details and yes. get all juiced up <laughs> yeah thank you right on. From Inspiral the Cafe. power of the grass thank you and remember coconuts is where it's at the green coconuts is the living juice it's under pressure when you open this it's like psh, you get baptized <laughs> every time I you know, know. it's amazing cheers salute to the life <laughs>